Hey everybody, it's your boy Nate. I am back with another Pokemon TCG Sword and Shield uh, pack opening. I have before me eight Pokemon TCG Blister Booster Packs. I used to call them Booster Packs. I guess they're called Blister Packs now. Cool note. Um, you will notice from my last minute video that I mistakenly, I mistook, excuse me, mistook uh, Gigantamax Snorlax as a Torterra. So, just going to go ahead and put that to rest right now. That is one of the uh, card arts, or sleep arts, for this expansion. I've also got the uh, Gigantamax Lapras, a Zakian, and a Zamazenta. So, one of each here. It all looks pretty freaking cool. I've also got some card sleeves from that Elite Trainer box that I showed you earlier, um, ready to go, so that way I can store safely all of my sweet new rare cards that we're going to pull today hopefully fingers crossed i also have a small showing off a small collection of my uh, mega construct uh, pokemon big fan of that series i'll probably uh, in the future sometime be uh, doing maybe a collection video or maybe even some build videos just to show off um, some of those because i am very into uh, building bricks specifically lego and then the pokemon mega constructs which i think are really cool so, without further ado, let's go ahead and get to opening these guys and see what we can get today. I'm still really good at opening these guys. Let's see. Ooh, ooh. We'll pretend we didn't see that. All right. Cool. One, two, three, four. All right. Energy card means I did it right. Crushing Hammer. Kingler, who with a hammer makes sense. A hyper Potion. Sizzlepede. Yamper. Clavipus. Cottony. A Choodle. Ooh, interesting. We've got ourselves an Inteleon. Reverse Hollow. Very neat. I love the patterning, patterning with uh, the energy uh, on these Reverse Hollows. And ooh. Oh, sick. Yes, baby. We got a trainer. It's a quick ball. Doesn't seem like it'd be that cool, but we, it is a full art, and I'm pretty sure that this is a secret rare. Um, I'm going to have to get confirmation on that, but this, uh, at least for me, is a really cool pull. Um, I've only pulled seven. This is actually the eighth pack of these, so for me, that is pretty freaking Cool. We're going to go ahead and put that in this sleeve just to keep it looking nice. Get one more quick look at that. Oh, man. Those full art cards are just so, so cool. All right. One down. Seven to go. Let's see how this goes. Maybe we'll keep that lucky streak going. All right. Four cards for the card trick. Flip it over. Ooh, hello. BD, who was really annoying in the game, I thought. But uh, always said he could beat you up, but never really could. Um, maybe I had a tendency to over uh, overtrain some of my guys in Sword and Shield, though. Krabby. Mudsdale Reverse Holographic, who's also a rare, so that's a pretty cool pull. And... Oh my god, you have got to be kidding me. What an amazing pull here. We have another secret rare full hollow rainbow holographic Lapras V Max. I am unbelievably impressed so far. I mean, this is two out of eight, and we are just hitting on all cylinders already. Um, looks pretty fantastic to me. I think the card condition looks good. We're going to have to put that guy in the sleeve. These guys are brand new, so they're not always super easy to get a card into. But, God, just already we just have two fantastic cards. I'm not a betting man, but I would love to know the odds on that happening in back-to-back -back packs. That is just ridiculous um, for me and hopefully you guys are as excited about um, these card pulls as I am um, 
that is crazy. I have that Lapras uh, Gigantamax in game uh, from one of the Raid Den battles. Very, very strong and very cool Pokemon um, to get. Two, three, four. All right. I don't know if we're going to be able to keep this hot streak going, but let's shoot for it. Let's see here. Sudowoodoo, Eldegoss, Energy Search, Sizzlepeed, Snoom, Snom, Snoom. I'm not quite sure. He's really cute, but I know that his evolution is not quite as cute. But, uh, you know, can't win them all. Got another uh, second Inteleon here. And a Lantern. Okay. Well, you know, we couldn't win them all. Still a cool card um, just to have in your collection. Might as well start opening them a little bit faster. As I say that, of course, my luck runs out with trying to get them open. Alright. Three, four. Perfect. Let's go. Psychic Energy. Dotler. Like the radar, Stunfist again would not want to run into that guy. Reboot, Diglett, Scoruppy, Hoot Hoot, are you? Score Bunny, pretty cool little cute starter. Pikachu card, always a plus to get in any pack. Reverse, Ghastly, neat, and just a Graplock. One thing I thought was really interesting about this Pokemon is that it only has the fighting type in-game, um, even though you can only find it um, chilling in the water, so I always thought that was weird that they didn't give that a, a cross-typing, at least in-game, you know, maybe they'll, maybe they'll correct that one day, who knows. Um, Alright, so we're halfway through the packs now, we've got four more to go. Alright, four cards, let's see here, fighting energy. Poke Kid creeping through the underbrush there. Energy Search. Team Yell Grunt. The uh, most annoying but least interesting, probably, uh, antagonist in any of the games. Sinistee, Maractus, Pikachu, Galarian Mouth, Marnie, Reverse Hollow. She's pretty cool and obviously a rare card. And a Turtonator from Sun and Moon. He's pretty cool, but, you know, not quite as cool as some of the cards we've already pulled today. Let's see what else we got here. We started so hot, now I just am uh, feeling like every single card is supposed to be the best card ever. Let's see. Maybe if we get some good mojo here. Water energy. Maybe get one of those sweet uh, VMAX cards. I know Charizard's probably the one you want to pull, but I mean, that can probably be said for, uh, you know, literally any set of Pokemon cards. We got a Reverse Cottony and a Roserade. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Get those out of the way. And then there were two. Come on, Snorlax. Maybe you'll give me a namesake here. Two, three, four. Let's see how this goes. Grass energy. Drizzle. Looking emo AF. Stunfist. Pokemon Center Lady. Slizzlepeed. Wooloo. Grookey. Sobble. Rhyhorn. A Vitality Belt. Always can use one of those. And a Thievel. Fantastic. Last. Last one. Let's see how this one goes. Oop, forgot the trick. Pretend you didn't see that. Okay, one, two, three, four. Channeling my inner Bob Ross right now. Just great ball. Galarian Lanoon to go with all those Galarian uh, Obstagoons that we've been pulling. Rhyhorn, Rookady, Krabby, Grookey, Mudbray, a Citrus Berry Reverse, and oh god, a Delmise V. What a beauty! All right. 
not a bad card to pull for our last one. I don't think it's necessarily worth that much. Centering's a little bit off, unfortunately, from left to right. You can see that pretty easily there. But all in all, still a pretty, pretty cool card. I actually am a huge fan of this Pokemon. Um, I think it originally came out uh, in this Sun and Moon expansion. For me, I think he's, uh, you know, he's a little disappointing in game, unfortunately. You kind of were maybe hoping for another Aegislash style uh, Pokemon with how um, strong they were, uh, you were hoping he would be, but he ended up just kind of being a little underwhelming, but I still think he's a really cool card overall. Um, looking back at what we did today, of course, this VMAX Lapras is just beyond beautiful, this Rainbow Rare. I cannot believe I pulled that, and as well as this, uh, this Quick Ball All Hollow. Um, just fantastic, beautiful cards. I, I, I'm not quite sure the value on any of these. I'm going to have to look it up online and maybe add that in after the fact, just so you guys know. But, uh, you know, that's it for today. I appreciate you guys, appreciate you guys watching. If you uh, happen to like the video, if you wouldn't mind actually liking the video, hitting that thumbs up button, I would really appreciate it. They're always appreciated. And, uh, you know, if it's your first time to the channel, if you could hit that subscribe so you can get notifications for future videos, that would be great as well. Uh, hoping to get to 100 subs here. Um, not sure exactly what I have planned there, but uh, you know, we'll see how she goes. If we can get to 100 subs, I'll definitely try to try to plan something for everyone. So thanks again, and uh, have a good one.